Hey there everyone. Now in this video, we are going to see how we can execute uh, raw SQL queries in Prisma. So what we are going to do is we are going to fetch all the articles of this user ID. So I have created a get route here. So let's try to do this. So we'll say await uh, Prisma dot and Prisma offers a utility function here, which is query raw. And when you like pass this query raw, uh, this back ticks and followed by back ticks. And inside this back ticks, you can write your uh, SQL statement. So what we are going to do is we are going to start with pretty base, basic SQL statement. So which is select, uh, we'll say everything from articles and we'll say where user ID is equal to and we'll pass the user ID from params which is request dot params dot user id and we'll store it inside some variable const our result is equal to and then we will simply uh, return this result sorry we will say response dot json and we'll say result so let's try to execute this we will say HTTP, let's use this one for uh, user one. So hit send and you can see that we have all the articles of user one. So let's uh, increase this. So yeah, you have all the articles of user one. Now, what you want to do is we want to fetch the user information as well. So we have to perform some joins here. So let's try to do this. So we will say select everything from articles and we will say inner join and inner join on user and we will say on articles dot user id is equal to user dot id and then we will say where articles dot uh, user id is equal to and we will pass this uh, request dot params dot user id so if you are familiar with like how to perform like how to write sql queries and joins this is like pretty normal for you so we will say select everything from articles and we are joining these two tables which is users and we are joining it based on the user id so articles dot user id is equal to user dot id this is the join condition and then we are passing the where clause where articles dot user id is equal to request.params.userid so let's try to hit send and you can see that now we have email as well so this is working obviously the response is not pretty structured so you can like write a custom logic to structure that response so yeah so this is how you can execute the raw sql queries in prisma and if you want to learn uh, more about raw sql queries you can go into this we have this concepts here in, uh, inside the docs and if you will go inside this prisma client i suppose and here you have a dedicated section yeah so here we have raw database access so inside like you can read about how to perform different things so we have seen that raw query how to perform this we have this uh, execute raw as well so it returns the number of rows affected by some sort of operation whether it's an update operation or a delete operation so the response will be the number of rows affected so this is uh, where you can like read uh, about the raw sql queries and how to perform those so see you in the next lecture